I finished NCE almost four years ago, but yet I couldn't get a job. But there is one school I am attending. It is a community school called Ahababu Maria Sunus Tata, where I have been teaching English, language, and government. And all my students are sighted people. And uh, they are happy that, yes, I am their teacher and I am teaching them to the best of my ability. My name is Tahuru Abdulhamid Idris. And I was born in the year 1993 in Kano State. I was born naturally a blind person that is uh, visual impaired. And uh, I did primary, uh, junior and senior secondary school all at special education school to the Maliki Kano State. Then I moved to Amina Kano College of Islamic and Legal Studies where I obtained NCE certificate in English Political Science. And I am now, I was now given a scholarship to study BSc Political Science by Professor Abdullah Wa Adamu at National Open University of Nigeria. I started my primary when I was a young boy because I spent 11 years in boarding school for, since from primary one up to SS3 and uh, all these responsibilities were taken by my mother. My mother was the, uh, is a person who helped me a lot. So in, uh, immediately after I finished that boarding school I joined Amin Kano College of Islamic and Legal Studies to study English. So we all know that begging is not wanted even islamically especially uh, so that this is why my my mother has been uh, doing it uh, her best to see that i am educated and i become self-reliant in my life career the life I, I, to some extent is not easy because in in that i mean in that tertiary institution that i attended I was the only person who is a blind in our class. We are almost 300 students and I am the only disabled person in, that, uh, in, in, in our class. But Alhamdulillah, gradually they accepted me and I perform as much as I can. Though I face many challenges from the teachers, from the staff, or from the lecturers, or even from my colleagues, that is my mates. But when they discover that yes, I can deliver, through presentation, through demonstration, through uh, expressing how we communicate with people, with normal people, then they realize that yes, people with blindness can do better. I took myself from home to school uh, when I enter this uh, Kekena Pep, it will drop me to the gate of the school. So then I will be linked to the security personnel at the school. He will take me to the lecture home or he can uh, take me to... In fact, when I go there, a, a lot of people know me, a lot, especially even, we are, even, even if we are not in the same class with students. They are happy, they will see me, they will lead me to our lecture room. Before the introduction of a computer, there is uh, a device which we call typewriter. When you type, the writing well, uh, should be a it should be a printed copy, like an ink. So we use that typewriter, and I memorize all uh, the alphabet of that typewriter. I type my examination, my tests, my assignment. So I use that typewriter to uh, to write my examination. There is one program called Global Arena, uh, which is aired at Vision FM Kano. So I featured on the program and the Professor Abdullah Uba Adamu heard me and he was very delighted and happy. Then he called through over the program and he said that he gave me the scholarship at, uh, in, in that university. This is how I got an, an admission on, uh, in the university. When he saw the news, he called the official of Daily Trust uh, to said that he would, uh, he, would, he would like to see me physically and to discuss with him. So at the course of that discussion, he tried his best. So he purchased me a brand new house. 
there is one proverb which says life is not made of roses but actually when the time i don't know what i feel i i say i i feel like it is a dream because imagine how i was how i looked like i'm a blind and i'm from forest family the fact that this person purchased me a brand new house i read i feel i feel happy not only i myself all my family my loved ones my people even the even the journalists who helped or who, who uh, go through the the interview we are all happy and we are all glad for for doing that and and my happiness will never be over emphasized the best way for me to be assisted is to get job through that getting job other people like me who are in begging situation or in a begging condition will say okay this person do, do so 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 education and now he is self reliant so why can we turn our our eyes to go to his line but if i am not provided with, with that uh, job so I, i will be staying like i will be staying like them maybe one they will be happier than than i because they are begging they are getting money but i even i have student i have all i have many students i have uh, many people who know me, who know my face so i cannot go and beg uh, beside the road because a lot of people know me i have my lecturers i have my student i have a lot of people who know me so i i still call on the uh, federal government and state government to please help me to get uh, to get a job permanent and functional job